My name is Kathleen Hermesdorf, and um, I'm a dancer. But for me, uh, virtuosity technique is it's extremely sensate. It's extremely uh, curious and informed, innocent and experienced at the same time. I watch how people land. I, I, so to me, virtuosity technique is how you meet the floor. How things happen inside you, understanding that. Not parts and places. Not parts and places. Not creating pain in the body. Not creating strife or stress. Finding pathways that move that take you to the ineffable. I think you can't suppress yourself. You have to reveal yourself. And I think you have to have um, something interesting to say. Like, you know, you have to have a point of view. I don't know if I did as a young dancer. Do you know when I think back? I think I came through like old school into new school and now into the new new school. And I don't really know where I fit into there. Um, but it used to be like you needed feet or something, you know, different eras of aesthetics. So now I think you need presence and self-awareness and, and, and a versatile body. So that's three things. The 21st century is very interesting for dance. I'm not necessarily training people for the same career I had, but maybe the same career I have now, which is making my own way and collaborating with people and finding those musicians I'm interested in and those video guys and trying to create projects. The economy is crashing everywhere. It is the time for entrepreneurs. It's the time to get toy. It's the time for creative minds. I think certain people naturally stand out, so there's, like, energetically, some people are just, they already have a presence, but I think you can learn, you can learn it a little bit, too. I think that there's a way that, that it can rub off, also. Like, um, for me, I, my teachers always told me to play with people that were better than me. I always think people should dance with people that are better than them. Um, AKA, AKA, go to class, you know what I mean? I don't think enough kids go to class anymore. Honestly, I think it's a daily practice. Like I said, it's a daily practice. People's attention spans are a lot shorter nowadays, even in the time I've been doing it, which is not so long, 22 years or something. Um, people used to, to revere class more, and I think that there's something to be said for that. Um, you can't really learn how to do it until you're around people that are doing it. You know, my teachers always, my tabla teachers were always really loud, and they played really, really strong, and that was how we learned how loud you were supposed to play. I couldn't do it in my own room. I always thought I was great, and then I 